Hey guys, ADHD here, and today is video doing a tutorial on how to remove all the water from underwater structures. Um, I've actually already touched on the subject before. I showed you guys my method on how I remove water from these underwater structures that I do, like my house videos and stuff. And what I did before was, like I told you guys, put gravel everywhere and then use torches to remove the gravel, which is a really, really good idea. But you guys are so smart and geniuses. Well, I always love your guys' advice and your guys' you know the opinions on stuff. Is you guys actually, you know, people in the comments actually told me about this method, and I thought I would share with the rest of you guys, you know, because it's such, it's I, honestly is a better method than mine, and it's a really good idea. So basically, what you do is, let's say this is full of water. What you do is you grab oak leaves or any kind of flammable object, the same way I did with the gravel, and you fill it the entire thing up with it. So you just take, you know, whatever the object is and fill the entire room with it. Obviously, this is a little bit exaggerated. It's a really, really big room, but um, we're gonna go ahead and fill this whole thing up real quick. Alright guys, so now I have this whole thing full. It is pretty crazy. It's so, you know, gigantic. Um, what you're doing is probably smaller, but this is a good example. The reason I told you guys last time to use gravel is because it falls like this, and it makes it a little bit easier to fill it up. But honestly, to fill this whole thing up, it only took me like 10 to 15 minutes, or max, 50, maximum 15 minutes. And I know a lot of people told me to use sponges in the last video, but sponges don't work on Xbox right now, so this is the best method. Um, all you have to do is get it filled up like this, and then make a couple little grooves in it and light them up and once you do this it'll go really quickly again you can use any kind of flammable block I would recommend oak leaves because they seem to be most flammable you can use wool or wood wood planks probably the easiest because they're easiest resource it's flammable to get probably um, but you can use really anything that's flammable like I said and it's really easy you can just go get something to eat real quick or go to the restroom whatever you have to do listen to your favorite song you know, it gets done in like a couple of minutes instead of you breaking each block individually you have multiple different, you know, spots that are being broken at a time. You can light up even more to make it faster. Um, but yeah, this, again, this came from you guys, actually, in the comments that actually told me how to do this. Um, I really like my method, but I'm really glad that you guys showed me this one, because I'm going to start using this one instead, because it's actually far superior. I don't think YouTubers always often give their audience credit for how smart some of you guys actually are. Um, you guys are really, really smart, so thank you guys for giving me this idea. It is an awesome method. And that is what I, that's why I wanted to make this video to update people to show them a more superior method. And yeah, so this is awesome. Uh, definitely recommend you guys subscribe if you're new to the channel. I do loads of Minecraft tips just like this, builds, you know, house tutorials, all kinds of stuff. So I definitely recommend you subscribe. And if you guys can give me the video with a like, I would greatly appreciate that as well. Leave a comment down below if you have any other methods or anything. Um, again, I know people keep telling me sponges, but um, sponges don't actually work on the Xbox uh, edition yet. So we have to do it like this. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching again, and as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Adios. All right, guys, welcome to the outro. Thank you so much for making it here on the left side of your screen, where it says previous video. And click on that, and that'll take you to the last video on this channel, where I show you guys five easy ways to make your house more defended in Minecraft, and it's pretty awesome. I definitely recommend you check that out, and it'll improve your houses a lot. And on the right side of the screen, where it says uh, recommend a video, and click on that video, and that'll take you to my last video on my other channel, where I unbox some Minecraft stuff, and it's really fun. I do it in a creative way, and I definitely recommend you check that out. And if you're on the mobile uh, mobile app, you can go ahead and click the card button on the top right side of your screen and get to both of those videos as well. But anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. Adios.